Madeline Oh my dad Baby Jova You know I be loving Welcome back to my channel. It's Trish. Um, I wanted to do a fall slash winter look. Whenever I think of a, like a fall look, I think of cool tone and dark lips. That's what I usually go for. So that's what I did. This is the look that I came up with. Uh, I did like a cool tone eye, dark lip. Um, yeah, if you guys like this look, stay tuned and keep watching. Everything that I use will be listed down in the description box. And do not forget to like, comment, and or subscribe. I will see you guys in my next one. I'm starting off with this tan shade from the 35O palette as my transition shade. The second transition shade I'll be using is the shade called Madagascar from the Nubian 2 palette. I'm taking the 35W palette from Morphe and I'm taking this darker brown shade and I'm putting that in my crease. I'm also taking this cooler tone brown shade from the 35O palette and I'm going to also be putting that in my crease. I'm taking this gold shade from the 35O palette and I'm using that as my brow bone highlight. Now I'm just going to be cutting my crease with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Fine. Now, uh, I'm just going to take the two crease shades that I used and I'm just going to be putting that on the outer portion of my lid. So, I'm taking this cool tone light brown shade from the Kat Von D Monarch palette and I'm going to be putting that all over my lid. Now I'm just going to go ahead and create my wing liner with the NYX Matte Liquid Liner.
I went ahead and did my other liner and applied my lashes off camera. I also went ahead and applied my Rimmel Matte Primer and my Maybelline Fit Me Matte Foundation in the color Deep Bronze. And now I'm just taking my Kat Von D Lock and Concealer in the color D35 Neutral and I'm just going to be highlighting my face and blending out the concealer. Now I'm just going to be contouring my cheekbones and around my forehead with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Mahogany. Now I'm just going to be setting my highlighted areas with the Sasha Buttercup powder and I'm going to be setting the rest of my face with my Ben Nye Translucent Powder in the color Sienna. Now I'm just taking my sleek contour kit in the color deep and I'm just going to be contouring my cheekbones and around my forehead with it everywhere where I put the concealer at. I'm just going to be baking underneath my contour with my face powder. And I'm just going to be dusting away that powder with my big fluffy powder brush. And I'm just going back over my brows with my ABH dip brow just to redefine them. Now I'm just taking this really light silver shade from the Kat Von D palette and I'm just going to put that in my inner tear duct area.
and now I'm just gonna be lining my waterline with the e.l.f. gel liner in the color black for my lashes I'm just gonna be using the wet and wild mega lash mascara and I'm gonna be using the NYX more than love mascara to coat my lashes blush I'm just gonna be using the sleek blush in the color coral and I'm just gonna be applying that to the apples of my cheek so I'm going to be setting my face with the NYX dewy setting spray and I'm going to be using the Becca highlight in the color opal and I'm just going to be applying that to my cheekbones my nose the middle of my forehead my cupid's bow and my chin Now for my lip liner, I'll be lining my lips with the MAC lip liner in the color Night Moth and I'll be taking the ColourPop liquid matte lipstick in the color Guess and I'm going to be putting that all over my lips. Thank you everyone for tuning in and watching another tutorial. I hope you guys liked the look and I hope you guys enjoyed it. All the products I use will be listed down in the description box. Do not forget to like, comment, and or subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one.